What's going on guys? It's Nick here. We got some crazy, crazy, insane gaming news. Now after years and years of rumors and trending tags for nothing to ever be there, we officially got a real life announcement for Grand Theft Auto 6. That's right guys, it's officially announced from Rockstar. They tweeted it out today saying, With the unprecedented longevity of GTA 5, we know many of you have been asking us about a new entry in the Grand Theft Auto series. With every new project we embark on, our goal is to always significantly move beyond what we have previously delivered. And we are pleased to confirm that the active development for the next entry of the Grand Theft Auto series is well underway. Now that tweet came out today, February 4th, 2022. So my estimation would be that we can see this game, I don't know, maybe by 2024, 2025. Uh, Rockstar is usually pretty good about not announcing anything till they have the majority of the game wrapped up. They guess they don't want the cyberpunk, you know, ordeal to happen to them to where they're, they release a broken game and people are expecting something phenomenal. I think they realize the gravity of GTA 6 and how how high the expectations truly are for it. Now I wanna get a little bit more into the details about the game itself. We don't really know a bunch about it, but we've all been hearing rumors after rumors, you know that it's probably gonna be either like in a Miami inspired Vice City setting, or maybe it's gonna take place over a bunch of places. As you can see from this little trailer playing in the background, this is a fan made trailer, so don't get too excited, you guys. I just thought these were pretty cool. I was watching a few of them earlier because I was so hyped up. But they said, uh, apparently they're releasing a new system for NPC navigation, which a lot of people believe is going to be used in the next GTA. So now what this is going to be for is basically to create more lifelike road users, which I guess is uh, more useful in a multiplayer network gaming community is what I'm seeing here. And I also see that the first time really ever, Dan Hauser will not be on GTA 6. At least we don't think he will be. Now, if you guys know who Dan Hauser is, he is the co-founder of Rockstar. And he worked on not only all the GTA games, but the Red Dead series, Bully, which I know everybody loves, I love, and Max Payne 3. However, his brother Sam Hauser does remain on the project, so that does look good for us. Now, I'm personally just so excited, guys. I grew up playing the GTA games, GTA San Andreas on the PS2. And I love GTA 5, but we've had it way too long, and we need a new GTA 6 ASAP. So let me know what you guys think. Are you are you excited? I mean, I know everybody's excited, but like, I, I don't even know. It's it, it's still blowing my not my mind right now, just knowing that we actually got it fully confirmed. I mean, would you guys be mad if it took until 2024? If that meant we were getting a phenomenal game that completely just puts GTA 5 to bed, or or do you guys want it even sooner, even if it you know is not as good? I don't know. I hope they don't go the full on multiplayer route and they give us a whole amazing, long, well thought out story like the old games. Let me know what you guys think they're gonna do down in the comment section down below. And let's go GTA 6. Peace out, guys.